Hello, people of internet land! Welcome, I'm Greg from GMH Games, and today, this is a let's play on Star Fox Adventures. Now, you might be asking yourself, why am I playing this game? I know the, I know the reviews and ratings are mixed and everything, but I like it, okay? Now, this is a little different than normal, so obviously you can see I'm not in where I'm normally filming. I am downstairs because I had... Okay, this one was stupid, alright? You could probably take a good guess that this is going to be a fun one. I've never filmed an old system before, so please bear with me that the first couple episodes will be a little eh until I get some feedback or ideas, just like it was when I try something new all the time. But you got to test stuff to get going, right? So, you may be asking yourself, Gregory, why are you playing such a bad game as a Let's Play? Well, because I like it, and it's my channel. It's not that bad, okay? It's just not a good Star Fox game. But, if you like Legend of Zelda, then this is the game for you. And I do like Legend of Zelda. So, this is gonna be how it goes while we watch this really long, boring cutscene that I have to get started with. So, you can tell this is gonna be a little different. It's an older system, so the resolution's a little weird. You can see my face cams in the top right corner here. And below me, there's going to be some kind of, I don't know, visual, since having the stupid thing show up like this is a little odd. I'm going to do that until I can figure out a way to not have it, to not have it so, like, con confined here, you know? I wonder if doing it on PlayStation... 3 would be better, but I haven't got a clue on that regard. Okay, so, bad language already. I don't understand the language, but it's a language. It's a video game. So, this is where this shit starts. Yeah. Okay, so I played this game a lot as a child, and I would always get myself stuck on various parts in this game. Oh, you know what, that's okay. You can't really die here anyway, so what's the point? Why, why do I take hit points if I don't actually die here? Fastest I've ever killed this thing, and I've never even attempted it before. Please leave feedback on this. I would really appreciate it. I know some of you watch, but don't ever comment what your thoughts are. But please, I know it's like this is my first time filming an old game, and I could really use some advice. I'm not really sure, honestly. I figured I would start with this game since it's got a lot of mixed reviews, like in terms of who likes it and who doesn't. Your adventure begins. Use left to move crystal around the galleon. Press L to center the camera behind crystal. Oh, if only I was able to center the camera, we wouldn't be having this problem. To be honest though, I did center it as best as I could and that's why we got nice old blue here on the left and right. Ugh, I don't like dark gritty places as it makes like the areas I'm filming not so entertaining When the A appears check the A display. It'll tell you what you can do at that time By pressing A you were able to talk to me when A appears again check the display as this button can do many different things
Here's another problem I have with this game. Why do I need to see this every time they collect something new? And she's looking the wrong direction from it. At least I think she is. I don't know. I always found these kind of humorous. That that much is for sure. God damn it, I can't fucking see anything. This is why I hate dark gritty places. It's King K. Rule's cousin. General Scales. Hiku, Kohud, or Taskuki, if dinosaur planet. Ud Neokraju, Ui Kimo Nekt. Am Dead Kutsuho K. Porigoi. Am Edko Kutsuho, Rosvejo Evu Tashkov Suk. U Tashkov Suk? Kiash Kuduk. I, I should be really honest right now, but this whole cutscene is making me kind of hungry, to be honest. Mowak, <laughs> Where to okay, he said Cold War more? He had such deck hello! You wanna hear a fun fact while this is going on? Did you know her and Fox actually have a kid in one of the endings of a later Star Fox game named Marcus? I'm not kidding, look it up. Seriously, look up Marcus from Star Fox and you'll see what I'm talking about. Proces General Moro Dokemo! I'm not sure. I don't know. This language always confuses me, so I try to. I try to, like. I don't know. I try to think of other things. The distress signal. The worst part is when it goes to like a movie format, the top and bottom kind of like narrow. So, you have arrived at Krizoa Palace. When you want to save your game, you must have a memory card inserted into slot A. Unless it corrupts it, press pa start to pause the game and display the save and quit options. Fuel barrel generator, it has been left here by General Scales, who uses the fuel to power his sharp claw army. Each time you use a barrel, another will be generated at this location. When the C is displayed, you can use an item from your inventory. Nah, -uh, buddy, get out of here. Oh, come on, it's just health. Come on, no! These are tasty puck puck eggs, a sharp claw delicacy. Don't worry, they are not dinosaur eggs. They come from the huge puck puck birds that the sharp claw breed just for this tasty snack. So, wait. Okay, I know JonTron made this joke, but I have to agree. Because, okay, so because it's dinosaur eggs, it's not okay, but because it's bird eggs, that's fine? You shouldn't be eating bird eggs if they're real birds in them. Alright, so... Yeah, I know the top part is a little odd too. I'm not even sure what to expect when I see this pop up on YouTube. Okay, so... Dun 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 dun! You have collected a... Dumble dang pod? It is a delicious fruit found only on Dinosaur Planet. You will find them in sharp claw baskets and crates or hanging in Dumble dang trees. All these stupid jellyfish things everywhere.
them dinosaurs are dying everywhere in here. The Krizoa need your help. They are dying. Was it you that sent the distress signal? When we were attacked, I signaled for help. We were massacred. But what were you doing here? The King Earthwalker sent us to protect this sacred place. Home of the Krizoa. The Krizoa are peace spirits. Powerful beings that bring life to a planet. Without the spirits, our planet is dead. Is there something I can do? My girl, only the pure of heart can take the tests. Enter the Krizoa Shrine. Once inside, complete the spirit's test and await your reward. If you succeed, then return to me. I'm not going anywhere. <laughs> this is a Krizoa Shrine entrance warp. Stand in the center and press A to enter the shrine. Damn, I need one of those in my house. Can someone explain to me why a game from 2002 has teleporters and we're almost in the year 2020 and we don't have teleporters? What a load of crap. You have found your way into a Krizoa shrine and within lies a Krizoa spirit. The spirits have been hidden as they hold great powers. Power that if in the wrong hands could bring terror, but in the right hands the spirits can bring peace. There are six spirits to find and return to Krizoa palace. If you can find the spirit within this shrine, and complete its test, then it will be yours. Mm. Oh my god. Get away! Oh, they make this shit impossible! This is a life force door. The spirits floating on it tell you how many bad guys you must defeat before the door will open. So just one. Fuck. Fuck you, Kratos! Oh, come on now, that's not fair. I guess I'm stuck in here now. Yo, know, I never really get a chance to do this, but I'm gonna go over to this big ol' mirror here. Dude, that's just trippy. I don't know. I don't know how to feel about this. Look at this. It's like the portal. All right, I'm getting uh, I'm getting ahead of myself. Test one: the test of observation. Watch closely where I hide. When the urns stop moving, you must show me which urn I have hidden in. Find me three times in a row, and I will be yours to return to Krizoa Palace.
Oh, come on now. You can't be serious with this. I get that it's the first test and it's supposed to be easy and all, but this is like... This reminds me of a Mario Party minigame. You know, I've never actually picked the wrong one on purpose. I wonder what happens. I'm not gonna do that, because this isn't easy. Gotcha! You did it! You collected the first Krizoa spirit. It will remain in your body until you take it to the Krizoa Palace, where it must be released. Aren't we already at Krizoa Palace, though? <laughs> the shrine to keep the spirit safe from harm. Ah, I can't get that annoyance to stop. But their powers are useless only when the Krizoa spirit has been released. Back into the palace. Can it be used to stop this war? A war, you say? Ah, jellyfish boy. <laughs> Alright, so just before we start this, here's some massive video game logic for you right here. Alright, notice how this is where I released the Krizoa spirit, right? Pay attention, there's nobody here, and there's nobody here either. I go behind both of these, there's no one there. Alright, watch this. Jeez, talk about creepy shit, man. For like, a little kid, this would have scarred somebody. I certainly remember this scene. Can you believe she was going to have a bigger role? <laughs> 